No! Wanna hand me? If you wouldn't mind. Love a good chase. I blame the weather report. There was no typhoon warning. Typical day in Wellington, bro. <sighs> Salvage these, you'd have to let the rest go. Oh my no. Don't you have everything on your laptop? My annotation, my highlighting. This is a disaster. Hey, cool it, man. You here for the conference? Yeah. Shouldn't we save the word disaster for bigger issues? Point taken. Next time, go totally digital. All right. Save a few forests. Don't push it. Just teasing you, bro. Let's start again. I'm Lani. Hi, I'm Sipi. Where are you from? Tuvalu. Cool. I'm from Nuru. We're neighbours. Hardly. Must be, what, a thousand kilometres apart? Nuru's so isolated. We need all the friends we can get. You're not alone there. Sucks, eh? Being a drop in the ocean? That's what we pray for, a drop in the ocean level. Our country's getting swamped. I had heard. Sorry, I can be a bit like a stuck record. Don't apologise. You've got the moral high ground. We'd soon have a physical high ground. Our main island's long and thin. Practically, it's all beach. Sounds like paradise. Except when a tidal wave hits. What can you do then? Head for the hills? There ain't any. Head inland. You'd soon reach another beach. Ah. Why did the chicken cross the road into Valu? Ah. Uh. To get to the other coast. If it's any consolation, things are worse in Nauru. We hold a world record. Least popular tourist destination. Even Somali is more appealing. Ouch. Nauru's a dump. Lani, you're a terrible ambassador for your country. Just pointing out the mess this in. That's my job. What do you work for? A muckraking tabloid? The government. No way. I don't have much choice. In Nauru, nearly everyone who has a job is a civil servant. There is bugger all else available. What's your line? Officially, environmental rehabilitation. Unofficially, screaming for help. Nauru's, li Nauru's literally a dump. Bloody prospect mining. The whole landscape's trashed. You have every right to be hacked off. So do you, Sipe. Friggin' industrialists. First they destroy our land. Now they're destroying our coast. Sorry, now they're destroying your coastline. It does hack me off. You don't exactly show it. What do you go on for? Protesting? Chanting slogans? I'm more of a subversive action chick. Misdeeds, not words. Sounds like trouble. Here comes my target. Play along with me. What? And keep your mouth shut. Can you manage that? Sure. Excuse me, will you take our photo? Gladly. Selfies are so lame. Look this way. No. Semi profile, please. Capture us gazing into the distance. Okay. Full of hope and aspiration. There you go. Perfect. Thanks ever so much. My pleasure. Have a nice day. Wait, shall I take one of you? No, thanks. It's the first morning of the conference, a huge occasion. Don't you want to celebrate? I'm good. We're going to achieve so much here. Preserve a memory. I have enough photos of myself. In semi-profile, gazing into the distance? Well... Full of hope and aspiration. Guess one can't hurt. Chin up, chit up. How's this? Great. Hold that pose. Focusing. Let's get you razor sharp. Done. Thank you kindly. 
Let's see. How do I look? Wow, commanding. Mm -hmm. I hope not. I'm a diplomat. Hodges, U.S. Department of State. I thought this conference was for Pacific Island states. We got American Samoa, Guam, the Northern Marianas. Those are territories, not states. Well, they're part of these states. Besides, I'm only here as an observer. An observer? Yes, sir. -y. We wouldn't dream of using our cloud to butt into your affairs. So you don't have any voting privileges? Honey! Heavens, no. We simply like to keep a friendly eye on what goes on in our backyard. Your backyard? The Pacific Ocean. What's your front yard? The Atlantic? Mm -hmm. Bullseye. How do you see the rest of the world? Kind of like a strip of grass outside our gate. We don't own it, but we like to keep it tidy. And you came all this way just to watch? You don't plan to actually do anything. Not diddly squat. At least you're honest. I suspect the delegates won't accomplish anything either. Business as usual suits us. Have a nice day. You were supposed to keep your mouth... Sorry, you were supposed to keep your trap shut. Tuvalu's a very peaceful place. Children play on the airport runway. Volleyball, football, it's perfectly safe. We only have three flights a week. When a plane through, a siren goes off. Everyone moves out the way, even toddlers. They've got an acute sense of survival, which is more than can be said for our species as a whole. We're like those kids on a runway, except when we hear alarm bells, we stay put. Disaster's coming, but we don't budge an inch. Speak for yourself. It's like I'm standing on Fonifutu Beach, shouting, go back waves. Waves aren't making the sea rise. We are up against people. Who have the numbers and the megabucks? It's hardly a hair, it's hardly a fair fight. Try playing dirty. You hacked his phone, didn't you? Gotta know your enemy. Lani, you have no right to invade people's privacy. We just did. Don't involve me. I thought you wanted action. Your tactics are unethical. Fine. Take my phone, report me. Delete everything. No, Sepai. Take a stand against criminal behavior. Make a citizen serious. I surrender. It's not funny. You'll have a clean conscience, like companies who buy carbon credits. Don't get me started on those bastards. Paying to pollute. They sleep easy. Maybe they shouldn't. Who's going to stop him? What exactly are you planning? I can only share with an accomplice, somewhere private. Lead the way. <laughs>